Now, Mark, this happened just after 4 o'clock this morning, but NDOT tells me it's taking crews so long to clean this up because of the slimy residue that was left behind from the cookie dough that burned in the back of that semi-tractor trailer. Now, take a look at the back up here. It stretches at this point all the way past I-69, and you can see they've got it narrowed down to just one lane passing here on the left, except for the people that are getting off at Chaitlin Avenue. Now, take a look at these pictures from Sky. Cam 6. Traffic has been snarled here for hours. Police say the semi was hauling a full load of cookie dough when the trailer caught fire. It happened in the southbound lanes of I-465 just under that bridge to Shadeland Avenue. So again, the backup between about I-69 all the way to about 56th Street. The driver of the semi was not hurt. Only one lane has been open for hours. That's causing the backup some points to reach almost all the way to Castleton. Now, NDOT told me that it did send inspectors out here to double check the structure of the bridge to make sure it was still okay as far as the integrity goes because you've got to think there was a huge fire under it, but NDOT says the bridge is fine. That's why they opened up the bridge to Shadeland Avenue earlier today. Lauren Casey is standing by in the Traffic Now Center with another update when it comes to all the detours. Lauren?